These latest brush strokes are the finishing touches. Small details on a painting that's larger than life. You have to um, make sure your lines are, are straight and it really needs to look like the person that you're creating. In some ways, it's symbolic for Monique Johnson. It's the largest portrait she's ever done. She painted this 36 by 36 canvas of Kobe Bryant standing at just two feet tall. Diastrophic dysplasia dwarfism. And so we're like the shortest of the shortest. So Monique holds the paintbrush between two fingers and carefully glides across the canvas. But even that doesn't always give her the best grip. Not only does my height pose as a challenge, but my arm reach isn't, you know, that large. And so I've got to turn and twist and lean and, you know, find ways to get colors certain certain places. That was, you know, just another reason why I shied away from doing this because I just didn't know if I could physically um, achieve greatness with this painting. And um, I, showed, I guess I showed that I could. Monique didn't set out to paint a Kobe portrait, saying it developed from a place of doubt. This particular piece, I had um, started out doing an abstract piece of, of, of art, and the colors were purple and gold. I didn't like the way it was turning out. And so I set it off to the side and said, I'll revisit that later, or I may just trash it. After letting it sit for a while, she was inspired to challenge herself. As I continued to work on it piece by piece, it started really shaping up into something beautiful. And so many others agree. It's been liked more than 1,000 times on her Facebook page. People are really uh, seeing who you are and seeing the greatness that lies within you, but seeing your hard work. It represents, to me, what Kobe stood for, the mumba mentality, that even though I had a doubt on whether or not it was going to come out right, whether I could reach you know, certain, certain spots of the canvas, um, I decided to just take a stab at it and, and just see what comes of it. I think Kobe did the same thing. In Jamestown, Natalie Wilson, Fox 8 News.